Hedgehogs should go extinct, especially this one. He's created too much chaos in the world, but they're cute. I can't lie. Although them being cute doesn't mean that these rats, I'm sorry, I meant large shrews, don't have a plethora of problems. Their biggest problem as a species is honestly self-mutilation. Since their eyes are really sensitive, if they get dust in them, they basically just rip them out. Kind of backwards, but okay. Actually, every part of their body that isn't their back, you know, the spiky part, is extremely sensitive and prone to injury. A hedgehog just walking around like normal could easily injure its leg or foot, and on top of that, the quills on its back could easily impale its skin where there are no quills. That is a double-edged sword if I've ever seen one. Also, subscribe to the channel and like the video or the hedgehog gets it. I know you guys like this one. A hedgehog's body is also so fragile that a stray human hair could give them foot necrosis because it could cut off blood flow if it wraps around their leg. If you had hedgehog problems as a human, wearing socks would be a life or death risk. It is a miracle that these creatures survived in the wild up until now and still live in the wild on Honestly, it's insane. Hedgehogs also get cancer a lot. It's extremely prevalent, especially when they're over three. They most commonly get it in their mouth or gastrointestinal tracts, which makes sense because they also have dental problems and gastrointestinal problems, which are also both common. Besides oral tumors, they also get gingivitis and preodontal disease, which are both common. And then just a bunch of gastrointestinal problems. The most insane bit though, hedgehogs might need surgery where they put them under if they have a carrot or peanut butter because it gets stuck on the roof of their mouth and they can't get rid of it. If you have one as your pet, I salute you because they sound like a pain in the ass to take care of and watch over. Then we have wobbly hedgehog syndrome, which sounds extremely cute, but it's not. Symptoms include falling over, muscle weakness, difficulty walking, wobbling when standing still, paralysis, seizures, head tilt, circling, weight loss, self-mutilation, aggression, urine retention, intestinal stasis, difficulty swallowing, spinal curvature, and death. And researchers don't know exactly what causes it, but it's a neurological disease that is most likely genetic. Not gonna lie, guys, this animal is all kinds of fucked. But this species, being this fragile and weak, surviving this long, they're doing something right. All right, boys, that's been the video. Thank you for watching. Click the end screen to check out more of my content and like, subscribe if you're new, and have a great rest of your day.